My name's Aaron Davidson. I am the CEO and founder of a small company out of Cody, Wyoming called Gunworks. And uh, we make long range precision hunting rifles. This is our specialty. Uh, we have pioneered the concept of a turnkey system, an out of the box system, so to speak. In fact, our trademark is thousand yards out of the box. So uh, uh, one of the things that we do that is the most significant is not only build a fantastic rifle, but we mount and calibrate an optic. We shoot the gun and break it in with, with precision ammo. And then we determine the ballistic solution, the ballistic profile for that combination. And we provide a, a method, whether it's a ballistic turret or a smart scope or a, a ballistic rangefinder for the customer to be able to attain that ballistic solution very simply in the field. So that you get an opportunity on a hunt that might be a little bit of an extended range with one button press, one knob dial, and a nice trigger squeeze, and you've got success. We're a hunting focused company. I love hunting, grew up hunting, uh, hunt with my family. And we're in the Rocky Mountain West where sometimes those shots can be a long ways. We've developed some very awesome systems specifically for shooting at long range for hunters and making sure that we're chasing that one perfect shot. So one of our latest products that we've developed is a Gunworks Nexus rifle system. And we've tried to break away from the traditional custom rifle based on a Remington 700 platform type program. So this is a ground up design that our engineers have uh, chosen as the next evolution of the Gunworks rifle system. We feature an aluminum receiver with a full diameter bolt, so we don't have lug raceways. The bolt locks up in the barrel extension, so that sets us up for very easy barrel changes. So a T25 wrench and five minutes, and you can have a new barrel installed on your rifle. It's not that meant to be a quick change or a takedown, but more a user serviceable or user configurable rifle system. We've got a double stack, double feed magazine that you can load from the top, or you can pull out of the bottom. This is a machined aluminum mag, so it's a very high precision product. It's very nice to use. And the whole gun itself is manufactured vertically in our shop in Cody, Wyoming. The recoil impulse on our Nexus stock and the mounting and configuration features are very nice. And it offers a really elegant design in carbon fiber, leather, anodized aluminum, and uh, carbon fiber on our, on our barrel. I'm really excited about the new Gunworks Nexus. Gunworks has a long storied history in developing cutting edge, long range shooting products, specifically laser range finding products with ballistics. We've taken that expertise and we've leveraged it into smart rifle scopes. Our first offering was the PMR that we launched in 2017 that featured some of the first generation technologies that we feature here in the new Radical RS25B. In this rifle scope, we have a micro OLED display that offers a heads up in the field display of your ballistic solution with a turret encoder and a ballistic computer that allows you to calculate your ballistic solution on the fly without leaving the scope. So as a shooter, I'm in the scope, I know my range to target, I just have to dial the turret, the range is displayed on the display, I take the shot. It's very fast, it's designed for hunters, and in this scope, our first iteration we're launching, it's just over 13 inches and it's just over 38 ounces. So comparatively, it's a very compact long range hunting scope with this awesome electronic system built right in. It's, uh, it's very configurable, uh, magnification ring, uh, a three turn indicators, illumination controls, capped windage, fast focus eyepiece. There's a lot of features in this scope, but the significant one is this Revic digital work stream. I think you'll be very excited about the technology that the Revic Radical Rifle Scope represents. Uh, my name is Rob Gibson from Spartan Precision Equipment, uh, and I'm just going to talk a little bit about our Hercules tripod system which I've got here. So the Hercules has a uh, CNC machined uh, aluminium head, uh, three carbon fiber legs. The carbon fiber legs, four section. And if I take a leg out, we look, because it's a gun platform first, not a camera tripod, we finish these with high quality aluminium fitted 
which reinforce the leg lengths. The uh, system has a uh, fully articulating ball head and we're using a proprietary disc lock adapter system. So this allows rapid attachment onto the disc lock. And the nice thing about this, this module is we can flick this out and we can drop in a standard um, camera ball fitting. So if you need to run a video ball head into here, that will also drop in. We can offer adapters for swatting scopes and binoculars, which will also fit in. The system has removable legs. There's three fold advantages of this for a tactical user. One, for insertion and extraction, it can come apart. You can break this down into small components. It will go in a drag bag. It will go in a, in a bag for a covert uh, insertion or extraction. You can employ the legs with a, with a handle uh, and a loop like a trekking pole, so you can actually use that if you're hauling a large load uh, cross country. You can use it because you're going to carry it anyway. You can use it for a, 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 a support for a basher shelter or also for a sniper screen or something like that. Because we can take that leg out, we can now run our tripod as a bipod system. Now the advantage of that, again, for the tactical user is in some spaces, confined space like a vehicle, a small room, um, you may not have room to set all three legs. Well, we can run this as a highly effective, highly mobile bipod system. We can use this seated, kneeling, standing. High angle shooting, I can get right under that gun for a high angle shot. For a plunging shot, I can get right over the gun for a, for a deep, deep shot, uh, deep depressing shot. As I said, it's a system. Because the legs come out, we could got the same tripod. We've got the Hercules tripod here, and we've got this now fitted with our heavy duty chat legs. This is a quickly adaptable system because in some environments, a full size tripod isn't gonna work for you. You've got to shoot off a small table or a bench you're going to need to replace those legs, a bipod's going to fall off the end, then run a small bipod system. We'll work on, a, on the roof of a vehicle, a turret, or from a small bench. On here, on this Barrett, Hercules tripod again. But all we've done now is we've added a rear support system. We don't need it, necessarily, but if I need to do a standing shot on a defined area, we've got an aperture, a door, or something like this, 600 meters, 1,000 meters, 1,500 meters, and I need a bench, then this is potentially gonna give me bench levels of stability in a system that is man portable. So, that's a shooting bench that I can carry in one hand. Just talking about two of our new tactical bipods that are new for 2024. This one here is our new Vida bipod, uh, and this one on the, uh, the Barrett here is our Kratos bipod. Talk about the uh, Vida first. So in many respects, conventional bipod, other than the fact that this one we're running with our new disc lock system. The advantage of that for the tactical user is being obviously to be able to remove the bipod rapidly from the uh, rifle. The adapter then can also be used with any of our tripod systems, so got a lot of flexibility from being able to go to prone, kneeling, standing, just by adding this to a, a different support system using the adapter. Attaches to the, uh, to the rifle, legs can be folded back and quick deployed down. We've got quick adjustable leg lengths here, which are incrementally adjustable. Under the rubber boots, we've got tungsten carbide tips for grip on uh, surfaces. In the forward position, we can mount that forward at about 45 degrees, uh, or we can fold it up in the very conventional way. And for storage, carriage, carrying it in a bag, putting it in a mobile gun safe, that can be taken off the gun until needed. Um, it's a real advantage for, obviously, uh, guys working in plain clothes where maybe they don't want to be having a bipod fitted to the, to the rifle all the time. You just have to run with the adapter on the gun and add it when you need it. Uh, the Kratos will also be available in a direct fit Picatinny and a direct fit M-Lock option. So for guys that don't want to go with the uh, disc lock system, 
there's an answer for you too. Moving on to the Kratos. This is really our uh, heavy duty uh, tri uh, bipod in this configuration. Um, the legs here are much more substantial, designed for these big calibers that are emerging, you know, the 375s, uh, 50 cows. And um, this really is a, a super stable, wide stance uh, bipod, which is robustly engineered to handle the weight using a, uh, a steel uh, horizontal spigot as the mounting. And the advantage of that is that we can remove the bipod from the rifle, from the spigot, when we don't need it for storage, carriage, transport, and we can add it. We have cant. We can increase the cant by removing a small screw from the spigot. Uh, incrementally adjustable legs, again, with our rubber boots and tungsten carbide tips underneath and multiple pitch positions for positional shooting. Hi, this is Mike with Barnes Bullets. We're at SHOT Show 2024. We have some exciting new things that we're about to launch here at the show. The most exciting thing is our brand new reduced recoil line. The reduced recoil line features an all copper Barnes type bullet with a tip triple shock in it. These tip triple shocks are a little bit different than our standard tip bullets though. We built these bullets specifically for the reduced recoil velocities, which means the muzzle velocity is going to work in this certain function window. From zero out to 300 yards, you're gonna get perfect double diameter expansion, even at those lower velocities. This is a great, great new load for you know folks that are recoil sensitive, maybe a new hunter, all those types of uh, fight types of customers. Uh, the bullets also feature a light blue um, tip on the projectile. This is so that it's easy to distinguish the full payload, the dark blue vortex round, or the light blue is going to be your light recoil, your managed recoil round. As far as Barnes um, goes in capacity and filling orders this year, we've done a really good job of getting caught up on our hand loading components as well as the Vortex and Vortex long range ammunition. So throughout this year, you're gonna see a lot more of it on the shelves. You'll be able to get what you're wanting, what you're looking for and, and have the, the best ammunition that you can use. Nailed it, perfect. Hi, I'm John from Sierra. Just want to give you an update as far as Sierra, what's going on in 2024. We're pleased to be supporting the Highland Outdoors Rifle Challenge. Um, for as far as Sierra, lots of questions about getting our components out to reloaders and getting caught up. Right now, we're sitting about half of our stock or half of our products in stock. We have a full plan to get totally caught up this year. Um, with that, we bought lots of new equipment, lots more things, lots of improvements. We've got a lot new, or we have nine more bullets coming out this year with different product lines, different equipment. Um, we have three different tip game kings, two different um, game kings, an outdoor master, um, and a few pro hunters. So should be a good year for us.